Hi, I'm Sam from Monkey Mountaineering. So, if you're thinking of doing the National Three Peaks this summer, that's standing on the summit of Ben Nevis, Scarfell Pike and Snowdon within a 24 hour period. And you probably might want to think about training as well. So the challenge is achievable, but I've guided around about a hundred of these now. Um, and whilst some groups, a small percentage, maybe 10%, really do smash it and come in in around 20 hours. And a small number of groups really struggle, maybe another 10%, and it takes them somewhere closer to 28 or 30 hours. The vast majority of groups do manage to come in in, in around about 24 hours. But they don't do it without first having done a little bit of training. So I'm just going to talk to you about training. I'm not going to talk to you about press-ups and sit-ups and all the type of things you might want to do in the gym because that's not my area of expertise. You want a personal trainer for that or someone who works in a gym and knows about that type of training. What I'm going to talk to you about is representative training and that's training that is designed to mimic the actual events that you, you're training for. So on the National Three Peaks, it's just walking. So what better way to train than to go out to walk? So Ben Nevis is the longest um, mountain you'll do on the, not on the National Three Peaks Challenge. And it's around about 10 miles round trip. And you climb around about 1,300 meters. So the best way to train for that is to just get out and walk. Get out and walk, aim to do 10 miles and look to try and do that um, at a speed of four kilometers or two and a half miles an hour. If you're going faster than that, that's pretty cool. Um, if it's taking you significantly longer than that, then you might want to walk a little bit, you know, push yourself, walk a bit faster. So by the time you get to actually be on the National Three Peaks Challenge, you're used to doing that sort of distance at that sort of speed. You know, four kilometers an hour or two and a half miles an hour is a, is a good target. If you get to five, to five kilometers an hour or three miles an hour, that's even better. Um, but those sort of speeds, if you've done, let's say, eight to 12 weeks training prior to National Three Peaks, if you're doing those sort of distances and those sort of speeds, then you should have no problem at all. But try and make sure you get plenty of different types of terrain in. Uh, you want to be going uphill, you want to be going downhill, you want to walk on nice paths, you want to walk on loose ground and rocky ground. So just try and get a good variety in. That's a good idea anyway, because if you always go out on the same walk, you're just going to get bored with it. You might not have time to go for a walk every day, but what you can do is you can do some other exercises to, to still prepare yourself for the National Three Peaks. So one great exercise that works uh, all of your legs, your glutes, your hamstrings and your quads is squats. So all you've got to do is squat down. Oops. And so just do as many squats as you can, you know, do three sets of 30, three sets of 20, whatever you feel comfortable doing. Another great exercise you can do is step ups. And all you need is something that's about knee height to step up onto. And just do as many as you feel comfortable doing. Maybe do three sets of 10 at first, build up to three sets of 50. So here you go. So don't forget to get out and carry a bag when you go training. Uh, remember, you don't want to be carrying a lot on the National Three Peaks, maximum of around about five kilograms. Um, but if you're not used to carrying a bag, then start off gradual. Don't carry a bag, go for a walk. And then build it up, start carrying a bag gradually make that bag heavier. You don't need to have a lot of stuff in it, just your warm coat, your waterproofs, hat and glove, bit of water, bit of food, um, but just get used to carrying a bag. So I hope you've uh, enjoyed watching this little video about how to train for the National Free Peaks. If you've liked it, go down there and give us a like 
and uh, why not subscribe to our channel again go down there and click subscribe uh, and then you'll get notified when we've made these crazy little videos um, thanks for watching i'm sam from monkey mountaineering